Today, we'll be taking a brief look at the Dell Power Edge T150, Dell's latest entry-level tower server. Despite its compact and quiet design, it packs a punch with support for Intel Xeon E2300 processors and up to 128 gigabytes of unbuffered error correction memory. Please note, however, that registered memory is not compatible with this system. The PowerEdge T150 is highly energy efficient, making it an excellent choice for small office environments. It also features a USB 3.0 port at the front and offers an optional slim DVD drive. Examining the system from the rear, you'll notice a wired power supply situated in the upper left corner. It's important to note that the Dell T150 does not come with hot plug power supplies. The system features an array of ports including an SVGA port, a serial port, an iDRAC port, five USB 2.0 ports, two one gigabit network ports, and a USB 3.0 port. Additionally, it has multiple PCI expansion ports. A standout feature is the inclusion of an iDRAC 9 port and lifecycle controller by Dell. The system is equipped with a single fan at the back, which operates quietly, akin to any Dell Precision workstation. Upon opening the cover to inspect the internals of the Dell T150, we find that it can accommodate up to four 3.5-inch hard drives. If you're using 2.5-inch SSDs or hard drives, you have the option to install more drives. However, it's important to note that this system does not support hot plug drives. This specific model is equipped with an onboard S150 software RAID controller, but it also supports hardware RAID cards, such as H345, H355, HBA355, H755, and HBA355V. The Dell T150 is compatible with Intel Xeon E2300 series processors, it features four memory slots, allowing for the installation of up to 128 gigabytes of unbuffered error correction memory. The system includes two PCIe Generation 4 slots and two PCIe Generation 3 slots. The power supply is wired, and there's room for a slim DVD drive. We're about to delve into the components that we will use for this build. The CPU, an Intel Xeon E2334, falls on the more affordable end of compatible CPUs. We'll be incorporating four memory sticks, amounting to a total of 32 gigabytes of memory. Additionally, we'll set up two SSDs, each with a capacity of 480 gigabytes in RAID 1 configuration. These SATA SSDs are an excellent selection for the operating system. The heatsink, made entirely of aluminum and devoid of any copper pipes, is adequate for this low wattage CPU. In summary, this setup is a solid choice for a small office domain controller, and we have the option to include two larger hard drives should we decide to incorporate a file server service. All components have been successfully installed. The caddies we utilized can accommodate up to two 2.5-inch drives per tray, simplifying the process of adding more drives in the future. The remaining two trays are currently unoccupied, but they have the capacity to house 3.5-inch drives should we decide to incorporate a file server service down the line. The system is operational, with two SSDs configured in RAID 1. We had to procure Windows drivers from the Dell website, as this isn't a hardware RAID controller. The system operates quietly, more akin to a regular desktop than a server. This server is ideal for a small office of up to 15 people. The standout feature of this system is IDRAX 9, which allows for remote system management. Its low power consumption and minimal noise are also significant advantages.